This is a 12 inch LCD writing tablet. So I just got this. I'm excited to try it out. Like the main thing is, you know, like no chalk kind of caught my eye is like you can use this as a chalkboard. So I thought it would be great for my nephew who is turning three. He has a chalkboard, but it's very messy, you know, to use a real chalkboard. So I thought this would be great um, as an alternative to, you know, like an Android tablet or such because he does things like purchase stuff off Amazon whenever he has a tablet. So, all right, so let's see what this looks like. Okay, so it's pretty thin. Let me pull this out. It's got a picture of a mouse on it. Oh, and can you also use it as a mouse pad maybe and a ruler on there? Okay, so we've got an on off switch up here. I'm going to just turn that on. Okay, so here's the front. It's got the pen is in here. Like, okay, so it just slides out. Well, your stylus, I guess. So let's see. So I, so um, there's no pull tab for this. It is supposed to come with a two-year battery in it. So let's try it out. Did that do? Oh, on the camera screen, I cannot see it at all. In real life, I can. Let me see if I can get that. Like where you can see it if I sort of adjust the exposure there. So. So, hmm. Okay, so it does show up in some lighting. But let's see if I can, like, get that to be normal light condition there. But doesn't have a great viewing angle not sure how well let me see if I can get this to adjust exposure back again all right let's hit the delete button oh okay gone wow that's neat okay it does kind of fingerprint up quickly all right so let's try some more let's uh All right, so see if you guys can see that. You know, it is not as bright as I was expecting. Let's see if different pressure is kind of pressing really hard versus just lightly pressing there. So yeah, pressure definitely does make a difference. I'm just gonna kind of go back. All right, so if you were sketching and you wanted to kind of just lightly sketch it out and then kind of go over it it looks like it would work for that so that is a little more bold um, all right let me delete that so would it work for something like a to-do list let's see so let's try to do. Alright, so things I need to do. I need to like buy cake mix for my nephew's birthday. Let's see, can you see that? Alright, so just gonna and the heavy pressure here. Alright, so let's see. Hmm. Wonder if you can write with the other end of this. You can write with the other end of the stylus too. All right. Well, I'm going pretty hard, deleting it, and let's see. Well, there is. Can you see that? There's a mark. But I think that might just let me. Okay. Let's see. I can kind of just buff the mark out with my finger though. So it doesn't look like even firm pressure is leaving a permanent mark. Oh, sorry, laundry timer going off in the background there. All right, so I'm actually going to go grab, let me I'll just grab and come right back. 
All right, I went and got just a nice smooth ended pen here. I'm going to see if you can write with other objects. Yes, you can. So if you lose this, it will work with just like the back end of an ordinary pen. All right, so let's see, thoughts on this. Mm, I'm not sure it's worth the price though because it's really not very bright. I'm actually pretty disappointed in that. Um, if I get it in sort of different lighting conditions, let me switch my overhead light off here and I'm going to open up a window so that you can see this in daylight. All right, so there is daylight. Let me kind of adjust the camera here. So, I mean, it's really difficult to see. So I'm going to turn the overhead back on. It is definitely, uh, sorry, the camera's having a little trouble readjusting after I changed the light on it. All right, hang on. Let me see if putting my hand on the black will help it focus there. Okay. So, let me clear that. Um, I mean, you really can't see it unless you're in pretty bright light. All right, sorry, my camera is trying to adjust for the black again. It didn't lock focus. So, yeah, I, I you know, if you're just writing gently on it, um, it doesn't show up that well. A firmer pressure is definitely better. So unfortunately, I don't think I can recommend this one because it's just not that bright. If I take this into a room that doesn't have really bright light or just like daylight, I can't see it. So, I mean, can you, is that what you were expecting? I sort of thought it would glow. Um, yeah, so I think normally this is $24.99 on Amazon. They sent me this one to test for free, so uh, they're not going to send me anything else probably, but you know, I want to give you guys an honest review here of the product. And I just don't feel that that shows up very well. I mean, can you see that? Like, not really. So I'm gonna say for me, this one's a pass. I don't think my nephew would enjoy this. He can't really see it. Um, I don't know, maybe if you got it on sale. <laughs> but yeah, for $25, I, I don't think it's worth it. All right, so if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more product reviews.